is up with this be I have such bed heads. I have like the worst bed head in the world. God. No wonder I can't get a real job. <laughs> let's just, let's get into the video. Let's. Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Star Lord. Welcome back. And today we have a bit of a different video. We are going to be reacting to the very first gameplay that has ever been released of Pokemon Brick Bronze. Now you guys may be thinking, well Star-Lord, that's not that great. What are you talking about? Anyone has gameplay of Pokemon Brick Bronze? Well, no, not exactly. So many of you guys actually probably don't know, but Pokemon Brick Bronze actually released back in 2011. And T-Brad and Lando's project really didn't kick off the way they planned, so they kind of just stopped working on it. And years later, they came back and made it into the game we all love and know now. But, lately, Lando actually made public the gameplay of the 2011 version of Pokemon Brick Bronze. Now, I've never seen this before. This is a first for me. Now, I feel like this is going to be a very different game to what we play now. So, I kind of thought, why not do a reaction with you guys and watch it together? Because I know many of you guys probably don't know what Pokemon Brick Bronze looked like back then either. So, this is kind of a first for all of us here, guys. Uh, so, without further ado, I'm going to put on my trusty headphones right here. And uh, here is the gameplay, so we're gonna watch it right now, guys. Where is it? Where's my mouse? There you go. Okay. t Dam. The opening screen looks so different. What is that? Whoa. Okay. Wow, that E looks very messy. What? What? What the hell? Are you kidding? Shut up! It was originally going to be sprites? Are you kidding me? Oh! What in God's name is this? Oh my God! That's insane! Wow! That is completely insane, guys! Is that all of it? Is that the whole gameplay? What?! I'm just editing values to change the image of the Pokémon following me. So far we have all 3rd gen sprites loaded. Oh my lord! He's got Skeptile! That's insane, guys! Who knew that this is what it was, was back in the day?! I honestly didn't feel like it was going to be anything like this. I didn't know they used official Pokemon sprites. Oh, <gasps> what? Wait, the music stopped. He's got Flygon. Oh, he's just kind of walking around with the... Oh, that would have been so cool to have those guys following you. That would have been so cool, right? You have the Deoxys. Um... Oh, what's this? Right here, Roblox broke a billboard GUI feature in their latest update. <laughs> what is going on? You're supposed to see all the image of Trico and Mudkip in the image, but after the update, blah blah blah. I didn't see what it said. If they ever decide to fix this feature, T Brad and I can pick back up this massive project. Okay, so this is where they originally like things went bad. Wow. Okay, that was it. Okay. Whoa. I mean, seriously, who would have known? Let's just go back a little bit. They actually had real sprites in the game. That's insane. I mean, I, I honestly would have preferred it the way it is now. I, I really like the whole, like, kind of 3D model version of the game. It, it makes it feel better, you know? The way you can change your camera angle. But I'll be honest, if I first played Pokemon Brick Bronze and it looked like that, but polished and nice and clean, I would have been like, wow, this is the real deal. Because I remember when I first played Brick Bronze, uh, King's Gaming actually told me, yo, there's this game on Roblox, uh, it's called Pokemon Brick Bronze, why don't you try it out? And when I first logged on, I was like, what in holy hell is this? What have I walked into? And I did judge it by the way it looked, because, you know, it didn't look anything like a real Pokemon game. But as I got on and played the game more and more, I was like, wow, this is actually pretty cool. I can see why people like this. But I wouldn't have minded if somebody made a Pokemon game like this. That would be pretty cool in Roblox. That'd be extremely cool. 
but I would know that there'd be like some kind of copyright issues maybe because you're using like the exact sprites pretty much everything from the original game in terms of the uh, models so yeah that is insane I thought the video would be a little bit longer and it'd show off like a route 7 or route 2 you know or something like that but no it kind of just showed off what it was originally looking like back in the day that is insane that is insane, and I would never have thought that is the direction that uh, T-Brad uh, wanted to go into in the first place. That's just crazy. But um, I'm pretty happy with how Roblox looks now, or Pokemon Brick Bronze looks like now. I'm, I'm happy. If they do decide to pick up a project that looked like this with the sprites, I would feel that's pretty cool too. But I doubt many people would actually play it, because you kind of play Roblox because it looks like Roblox, you know? Not because it looks like Pokemon. Maybe they could do like a separate game outside of Roblox where you download it from your desktop onto your desktop and it's nothing to do with Roblox and it looks like this. That'd be pretty cool too. But um, for now, let's just keep it the way it looks, guys. Uh, but anyway, guys, are you surprised that's what it looks like? Please comment down below if you had no idea that's what it would have looked like back in 2011. Me, I am just, I'm pretty shocked right now. Um, but yeah, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Please remember to give it a like and go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.